hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix the issue with microsoft dotnet framework while installing or playing any game you got the error unhandled exception has acquired in your application the system cannot find the file specified let's fix it guys you just need to right click on the start icon and select settings on left side select windows update on right side select check for updates if you have any available update listed over here then you just need to update it guys and make your operating system up to date and after doing this close it up here go to search menu and type windows futures comes up tan windows future on or off click on open it in here you just need to expand dotnet framework 3.5 and check mark all of these and expand dotnet framework 4.8 and check mark all of these and expand inside of it and check mark all of these and select ok this will install all the relevant dotnet framework files guys after finishing this select a close and now you can check if the problem solved or not if not let's move on to the second solution guys you just need to check my video description for this link used in my video select the download option and download the DirectX and after getting download done you just need to install it guys after the installation finish you can check if the problem solved or not if not let's move on to the third solution guys you just need to right click on the start icon and select run in run window you just need to type app wie set dot cpl click on ok in here you just need to scroll down in here you can able to see lots of version microsoft visual c plus plus you need to select one by one and select uninstall guys every version you need to uninstall the microsoft visual c plus plus after doing this you just need to close it off here you just need to check my video description for this link used in my video select the download option select any server and this will download the microsoft visual c plus plus runtime all in one after getting download done you just need to select folder icon over here right click on the downloaded file and select extract all and select an extract After getting extract done, you just need to right click on the install all bat file and select run as administrator. This will install all the Microsoft Visual C++ versions in your system. After installing all of these versions, you just need to close it off here and check if the problem solved or not. I hope one of these solutions fixed your problem guys. If the video helped you, don't forget to leave a like guys. You can also subscribe me and support me guys. Thank you.